Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Splatoon 3. Now, to keep going through more of this world, let's go into level 4. Barriers, they've got you covered. Defeat Octo Discos and reach the goal. But first, I have to find out what Lil Buddy's found. Probably just a bit of fish eggs, yep. Which we have a lot of at this point. 15,000... Yeah, 1,500? No. I don't know. I don't know anymore. 1,500, I think? No, it was 15,000. I'm just crazy. Let's take the hero gear. Okay. Needs to be careful of the barriers with this level. Once we get further forward. Is that working? If you want to take down the Octodisco, you got to hit him from up top or go inside. Because we can go inside the bubble to take them out, but it's a little bit more dangerous since we can get splattered. Take you out. <laughs> I love how it's a disco ball. Enemy. Keep it up. It's probably better to take out the Octodiscos from above. Froom goes the propeller. Amped Octo Stamp. There we go. There's a lot of stuff in this level, apparently. Some armor. That's not what I was trying to do. That's fine. That should work. Also, it's moving. It's very strange to see it moving. That was very satisfying to blow those all up. Okay, let's keep going. Need to conserve some amount of ink. This is going to be annoying. Yes, it is. So let's make our way up this way very carefully. Oh, hello. You're actually making your way up. And also that isn't actually hitting me, apparently. We'll get rid of you and that. Ow. Come on, we got to keep going. Wow, you're thorough. Thank you. Making sure to get all the secrets, which aren't actually secrets. Going up. Just don't look down. Nice. Activate that. Gotta go through that ring. Ha, ah, sweet. Go to here. Nice. Not bad, Agent 3. Take a look at this. There are quite a few things here. How do you want to tackle this, Agent 3? I'm just going to go in swinging. You're almost there. Psych yourself up. Let's do it. That missed. That's fine. Let's take that out so we can take that out. Got a lot of shields to deal with in this. Let's take a second. Let's go up. Take it out, please. Thank you. Let's keep going. We also have this thing here that we could use, quite possibly. We can wait a second. And just take it out. I don't know. That's a goal. Mission complete. Need to also find the rest of the secrets in the overworld here. In this level area. Sight. Since I believe we can do all of that now, since we got rid of all the goop already. Um, hang on, map. Okay, there's a few areas that are green. Quite a few. Let's go over here to start off. Work our way in. Okay, little buddy, do you see anything? Is there something down there, maybe? Yes. Grab that, fish eggs. There's still more stuff here. Somewhere. I assume it's something on the other side. Somewhere over here. Oh, that's not... The, that's... Sorry. Something over here. Nope. Hopefully, maybe. She's probably further up, I assume. Maybe. Just keep covering more ground and hope that something shows up. Hmm. 
Anything, little buddy? Apparently not. It's in this area. So it's probably over here or something. Maybe. Little buddy's not finding anything. What am I paying you for? Nothing, though. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Let me... Let me jump over here and see if there's anything on this side. Well, I see something. Let's grab that. Another decoration. Still something over here, though. But where? Where is the secret? Is it down here somewhere? Is it up here, maybe? Little buddy, where's the secret? Show me. Where is it, boy? Where is it? I don't know. It's not there. I don't think it can be up here, unless it is, for some reason. Nope. I think little buddy will pop out of my pocket whenever he we're near whatever it is. Anyway, so... I must be just not doing something right. Maybe? Is there something like off the edge that I can't see? I'd believe that somewhere. Well, of course, little buddy doesn't always find what I need for some reason. Where am I? Okay, I'm here. Not, not losing my mind yet. There's still time. Okay, so where is it? There we go. Why did it take you so long to find that? Okay, C scroll. Thursday night, Friday morning at 10 a.m. is the hundredth episode of Murray After Midnight, and a special guest stop by to help me celebrate. My cousin Callie is a Squid Sisters ga gab fest. We could not stop talking. Not kidding. We went over the scheduled t end time by five hours. Oops. That's good. That's a good one. See what else is over here. Well, little buddy's going off on his own. He might find something, actually. Quite possibly. Um, it's a pretty fast area here. I don't know where the little buddy went. Oh, there he is. Stuck. Okay, little buddy. Do it. Find it. Please. Nope. Okay. Um, this is a fairly big area to check. So let me go up this way, maybe? It's probably up here. Like, over there? No, over there. Nope. Somewhere back here. Come on, little buddies. Find something. There we go. Right there. Cool. Right where I was shooting. Why does that not work? I don't know. Sardinium? Three out of five. Okay, where else do we need to check? Over here. I love the overworld so much. Okay, little buddy, do your thing. Maybe. Do something, please, little buddy. Anything. I'm sure it's like right there, yeah. More power eggs. Can't have too many. I guess. Let's try up here. I guess we should get this balloon. Where are you going? This way, apparently. Well, that's a lot of balloons. Oh, that's not good. That's not good, that's not good. Come on, go, 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 go. Okay, we made it that time. That one. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Like that. Up some more. And there we go. Frying out here in Scorch Gorge. In more ways than one. Hashtag sweaty shell, hashtag 
biking trip. Look who it is. Very cool. On the Splatnet 3, I'm pretty sure you get to see more of his story. Um, okay, there's something else around here somewhere. Which is probably back here. Probably. Maybe. Down there. I'm, I really don't like how hit or miss this is. <laughs> like, please. Just find the secrets. You've been so good, usually. Something here? No. I think you have to be on a similar level to whatever it is. Oh, so there's apparently something over here. Somewhere. There's a lot of area that I haven't inked. There we go. Nobody found something. There it is. Another sea scroll. As they grow, crustaceans such as this coconut crab frequently shed their shells to allow for further growth. Because strong sunlight encourages uh, this shedding behavior, this may explain why Splatland's crusta uh, crustaceans uh, often grow to be f by far larger than their counterparts in other regions. Okay. That's that there, so we just need to go back up here somewhere. And figure out what I'm missing. Well, I can't go up there, apparently. It's more likely to be on this path here. Or something like that. Not there. Something here. I think there was an item here that we collected already, so it's probably not there then. What's the area? It's a fairly wide area. Let's try further down here, maybe? Like, it's actually probably on here, now that I think about it. Maybe. Nope. How far out does this stick? Not this far, actually. So we need to head back up. Ah, uh, little buddy, do something, <laughs> please. Something down here? No. Slightly too far out of the range. I've inked so many places over here already. Surely it's not just like... I don't know. I might be down here, even though I checked already, and you didn't find anything. Nothing showed up. This is starting to really annoy me, <laughs> because it has to be up here somewhere, and he's just not finding it. Come on, find something. I can't go up that way because that's out of bounds, apparently. Where? Where could it be? Where is it? Nobody knows. Somebody knows. But why doesn't the in-game helping little buddy help? Can't see anywhere that I've missed something. Nothing? Okay. I think I'm just gonna have to leave this secret wherever it is for now because I am losing my mind trying to figure out why it's not showing up when little buddy's in this area. They're like footprints or something. Am I actually leaving footprints? I think I am. Possibly, and also like lines. That's actually really cool. You can draw on the ground. Anyway, let's go to the next level since I can't figure out where the secret is. A compulsive collector's paradise. 
This is this is too personal now. Grab all power eggs within the time limit. This is too personal. <laughs> this is too personal. Taking the brush. Let's see how this goes. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's Pac-Man. <laughs> okay, well, um, let's go. Only have a limited time to do this. So we need to be extra efficient. We need to be careful of the flutter as well. Grab that. Nope, hang on. That's not good. We need more stuff and we don't have much time. Oh, really? Also ink. Also ink. Ink is another problem that I have right now. Okay. 28 seconds. And there's still plenty more to get. Ten remaining. Please be the last ones. Where am I missing one? Where am I missing one? It's probably in a corner somewhere. All right there, got it. That was close, cool. Oh. I don't know if that would be a collector's Paris paradise because of the time limit and also the, uh, whatever they're called. But anyway. I'll accept collecting the power eggs. Uh, let's head over here because there's also a green spot over here. I guess the map completion might help finding secrets. I haven't confirmed that. Also, there's never mind. There's not. There's no part of the map over there that's not seen anyway. Oh hey, found it. It's just that easy. Also, there's another one. Apparently, it's probably on a lower level, but it is probably here nevertheless. There it is. Sardinium. We have four, we need one more. Is there any more secrets over here? Yes, there is on the other side of this, I'm assuming. They seem to like doing that. Come on. Find it. There it is. More fish eggs, okay. And the last one, wherever it is. Um. Like, I've, I have a feeling that I have to do something like that, but also, I don't think that's going to work, so... One, one secret. That's all I need. One more. It's probably over here. Yeah, there it is. I just couldn't find it because it wasn't revealing, even though I painted the whole ground around it. Ah, uh, it's fine. Anyway, that's all of the secrets of this area, apparently. Very nice. Now I just need to fill in the map at some point. But not right now, so let's go to the next level. Zipping over the neighborhood. Use the zip caster to reach the goal. This is going to be a good one, I can tell. Zipcast Octo Brush. Okay, very nice. Slam Pow! Gotta get you. I have the power, so I might as well. Also, hang on. I want that. For some extra fish eggs. Splat secret. Nice find. Come on. I feel like speed in this power up is a really good idea. Doctor Commander. <laughs> well, he's not ready for me, apparently. 
Swing through the ink, dashing through the skies. Zip, 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 caster. There's a thing shooting at me, so we need to be careful of that. Take you out. I am far too powerful with this. Far too powerful. Zipcaster is so powerful when it's unlimited. Oh my goodness. Even when it isn't unlimited, it's still super strong. Take that. Very nice. Come on. Oh, really? Well, I'll do that then. Come on. Like that. Take out these Octo Discos. <laughs> I think that's what they're called. I can't remember, apparently. Also, can't we just go over the wall? I'm pretty sure we can just go over the wall. Let's grab this key, though. We need that. For something? Yes, over here. It's a mixture of fish eggs. Oh my gosh. That's a pre-packed power egg party in here. And let's get out of here. Absolutely amazing level. And just over two minutes. Could have been just under two minutes, but still. Especially if I skip the wall. Okay, next level. All the way up here. One way ride through Target Town. Destroy the targets to reach the goal. Seems like a good deal. Try sting a splat bomb. Let's go. Should be a good combination of things, I think. Is that a rail there? Yep. Ready for some target practice? You have to hit every target you see. Cool. Please. I must have missed that. Also, oh, this place looks really cool. They've done such a great job of this world. Okay. Very nice. Let's jump. Okay. Good. Great. Super nice. <laughs> the next one after all the rest. Okay, very nice. Jump into that. Aim carefully. Nope, that's not right, but it's fine. I fixed it. Have these grates to go through, unfortunately. Okay, good. Wow, you're really good at this. I wouldn't say that. Tower of targets ahead. I think I got all of them. Good. That was close. Another great. Keep it up, Agent 3. Almost done. Okay, got two over here, so we need to be quick about that, and that, and then all of this as well, please. Ooh, I could have jumped without jumping sideways, but still. Okay, nice. Target destroyed. Wow, that was fast. I wouldn't say that. You're so close. Oh, low ink, but that's okay. That was a lot of work. Great work out there, Agent 3. Cool. I got very concerned there for a few times. Okay, let's keep going. And use splashdowns. 
Making waves with splashdowns. Use splashdowns to reach the goal. Interesting. Also, there's a lot of extra weapon stuff that I'm going to have to do at some point. Which I might have to do a whole thing on. Quite possibly. I don't know. Or I can just do it. Okay. Here's what we do. We're going to use splashdowns to destroy everything. Kasplat. You can do it as many times as you like. This is a splashdown level. Nice. Very, very nice. Oh, love it. Kablam. Another Propellivator. Go all the way up. Oh, it feels so cool. So cool. This one's going to move horizontally, though, so we need to be careful. Don't fall. Probably a good plan. Also, the music is really cool. Nice. All together now. Kabam! Goodbye! Very nice. They, they, they've made these special stages so good. Octo Sniper. Spin spotted. Let's just keep going. And then... Kablam! <laughs> you almost look too cool. I have that effect. With the splashdown. That was such a good level. I'm sad that this is the only weapon we have for that because now I only can play it once. Although I still have to play it on my main profile, so... I'm enjoying this game so much, I'm playing it twice. <laughs> that was so good. We have a lot of parrigs now. Uh, I might start working on the extra weapons now. Since there's still a fair bit of this world to go. Oh my goodness, there's another zip cast level. <laughs> we'll get to that. H3 Nozzle Nose. Considering this is a level that we need to keep fighting lots of enemies in, it's an interesting choice. We're going to have to play it a little bit slow to try and get through safely. Also, it doesn't seem like, unless you're aiming them at it just right, doesn't seem to take them out in one go. Unfortunately. Takes a few shots. Gotta do this again where I get behind them. Early. Oh boy, I missed. It's fine, we can shoot from above, I think. Maybe, or just try and blow them up. That works too. Oh boy. Where'd he go? Whoa. Teleportation. Oh, you do you do have that ability to move sideways. It just looked weird. Gluga Doolies. Should be good for this level. Somewhat long range, but a slow fire rate. Hmm, interesting. Try and use your sub-weapon, I'd say. So you can get closer with enemies. And work on other ones at the same time. So yeah, even though it does use a lot of ink, you definitely need to use your sub-weapon more. Just to balance things out. New record. Splat Roller. This is a lot of ink, but it is good to use the horizontal uh, throw. It's also good for just being right on top of an enemy and just taking them out. Yeah, the horizontal attack is kind of necessary for these enemies. Ah! Falling! Might even be worth trying to use my curling bombs for this. To distract them and then take them out from behind. Quite possibly. Their backs seem to be a lot more protected than the regular ones. This weapon is not great for fighting these. Like this. You've got to be kidding me. 
That's better. Need to actually be right on top of them to do lots of damage quickly enough to really work. Even still, it's not that great, but that's what I get for going fast, I guess. Oh well. Dapple Doolies. Short range. Somewhat quick. Firing rate. High ink consumption, as far as I can tell. No, it's alright. It does go somewhat moderately quick, though. Especially if you use your sub-weapon. These doolies are good for going fast, though, so you can actually avoid most of the enemies. Also, hang on, the other ones didn't spawn in. That's interesting. That's very interesting. Gonna get a good time, though, for skipping everything. <laughs> One minute, twelve seconds. Much better than the other run. Which is like two and a half minutes, so. Tentabrella. It's got a much bigger umbrella on it. It also feels slightly slower than normal. Just using it in general. Ow. Oh, ow. Gonna definitely do worse than this one than last time. But I might try and find those extra fish power eggs. This feels like a fairly strong weapon though. Ah, as long as I have ink to use. It might have a high consumption rate, let me see. Ah yeah, it does. <laughs> Very nice. Let's go over this side. Since we didn't do that last time, and there's a whole bunch of fish eggs over here. You're a regular crate, Magnet Agent 3. He uses so much ink. Let's grab some more fish eggs, and let's head back the other way. This thing isn't really built for speed, this weapon. It's built with power and... taking your time, I guess. Ow. Trying to not get hit by things as much by taking your time. Well, I guess if you can use your shield well enough, you're probably going to be fine. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. Also, keep in mind that it has a sub-weapon that you can use, which doesn't cost that much to use. Bunch of fish eggs in that box. But there we go. Splushomatic. The spread on this is going to be a little bit interesting for this level. But it should be faster than the previous weapon. Should be. It's a short range weapon though. Which means that taking out the Octo Snipers could be interesting. Depending on how I do it. Its spread actually kind of helps with moving around quickly. And if you can get above something you can do a lot of damage apparently. Very nice. That was a good weapon for that level. New record. And I even went out of my way to get the extra fish eggs. Try Stringer. This should actually be a lot better for taking out the... Octo Disco thing. I don't know what it's actually called. I think that's what it's... Yeah. Octo Disco. Why can't I not hit you? Come on. Please, thank you. That took a while. Oh, really? There we go. Spent so much of my ink trying to just get the Octo Disco. Probably worth using the curling bombs while I'm here. Guess it only has effect if there's stuff inside of it. Interesting. Might take this thing out first though. Like that, and now I can get rid of you. There we go. Ink spread is hit or miss. I think jumping and shooting is probably the best way to ink in front of you. And curling bombs are quite good because you can obviously swim behind them. And that feels like a better choice of sub-weapon for that specific weapon. Not as useful in that stage though. Unless you can get them inside the bubbles with the enemies. Sloshing machine. Seems generally good. I'm just interested to see how this works. Pretty well. Cool. Uh, why did I even need to try the other weapons? This one's so good. 
takes that out so much easier than the other weapon. It's just so strong and spread out at the end. And don't need to worry about jumping, changing the, the way it works. It's just so good. The only thing is it does use a fair bit of ink. Yep, new record with that one. That makes sense. It was a good item. A good weapon for the level. Splushomatic again. But this time it's Pac-Man, so this is going to be interesting. Oh, we have curling bombs for this. That makes sense. That's a good one. That's a good. That's a very good, actually. It means we can clear out the edges a lot faster. Get all of these. We can even collect stuff without even needing to collect it because the... The curling bomb itself does all the work for us. Basically. Ten remaining. Just have to fill in all the gaps that I skipped over. Two more. Where's the last one? Eight. Oh, I'm in trouble. I'm going to die, actually. There it is. Go, 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 go. No, you've got to be kidding me! Oh, I thought I did it at the zero seconds. I don't know. Okay, fine. Have to do it again now. Oh, that's not good. That's really not good. Nope, 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 nope. I'm trying to try and hit stuff on the way past, but also... It's not working that well. I think I can grab the ones up here, from up here, which is good. I good idea. As long as I don't run out of ink, which I am running out of, for some reason. Come on. Gonna run out of time at this rate. Ten remaining. Six, five, four, three, two... Where are they? Like, actually, where are they? Okay, I think I might be alright now. Somewhat. Just need to collect all those. All of these. And there we go. That was a bit difficult, but, um, yeah. Somehow a new record, though. He leaves a 4K. It's a long charging charger. Oh, boy. This is just a hard level, I think. Well, so apparently that counts as the time. I was wondering if it would count or not. Apparently it does. Gonna try and be a little bit sneaky. Just a little bit. Try and grab all these. Maybe. Have to actually hit them though, is the thing. And these guys are being annoying because they can see me when I'm up here. Unfortunately. Doesn't just count as being invisible. Stop. I have not much time for this. I don't have much time for this. This is sad. This is very sad. This is just a hard mission. I'm not sure how much splat bombs will work for this either. They might be helpful. Also, it's different from before. Why is it different from before? That's just rude. Why are you there? Why... Yeah, why is it all different? It's fine. It's all fine. Just need to be quick. Grab all those. Grab all this. And all this. Most of that. As much of that as possible. Ten left. Six more. Which I think they're all here-ish. Yep, there we go. Oh. Rapid blaster. This is alright. It's a blaster again. Which is good for these kinds of levels. And we don't have to charge it up. The only thing we need to keep in mind is the ink consumption. Which should be fine for the most part. Once again, this really reminds me of Portal 2. 
Like with the water everywhere. That was pretty good, although I still had a few warriors near the end. New record. A new record in an on rails level? Heavy splatling. A charging weapon. Oh, that's pretty good. Again, you probably want to go into squid form to cancel out if you need to. So you don't use up all of your blast and can recharge the next one. And it's also got a pretty good range. And don't always need a full charge either. Now that was satisfying. It makes pretty good work of that box at the end, apparently. Less worrying about that. Well, I finally caught up after almost an hour's worth of recording everything in this video. But that is it for now, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.